And our second presentation is uh, application of AOSPITE's bug show classification system for treatment strategy optimization. Uh, the first clinical description of patients with acute spine and spinal cord trauma dates back to 2500 before Christmas. The subsequent development of medicine has made it possible to achieve significant success in both treatment and rehabilitation of patients with neurologically complicated and uncomplicated traumatic injuries of the spine. The classification of traumatic spinal injuries is a key of importance for determining the tactic uh, approach to spine surgery. According to a number of publications, it is the precise aspect following uh, the algorithm for provision of care that is a condition that makes it possible to achieve maximum recovery of neurological functions. Analysis of literature in historical aspect reveals a significant number of classifications of cervical spine traumatic injuries. Here are the most well known ones. Uh, White and Punjabi classification of injured cervical spine instability, Allen and Ferguson mechanical classification uh, that was uh, later modified by Harris, another mechanical classification by Argensen, the cervical spine injury severity score that is a scale of instability, the suboxial cervical spine injury classification and severity scale, and the last uh, AO spine suboxial cervical spine injury classification system. According to official publication, when proposing a all spine suboxial cervical spine injury classification system, the goal was uh, to develop a comprehensive yet simple classification system with high intra and inter observer reliability to be used for clinical and research purposes. The purpose of this work was to establish whether a all suboxial cervical spine uh, injury classification system is a self-sufficient and universal tool for inambiguous determination of surgical treatment strategies. Uh, we have uh, analyzed neuro visualization data and surgery tactics of 168 patients with traumatic suboxial cervical spine injury hospitalized to the Department of Spinal Cord Pathology of Ramadan of Neurosurgery Institute is a period from uh, 2008 to 2018. Uh, in inclusion and exclusion criteria are presented on the slide. They are the same in the, uh, uh, the same with the previous record. In order to obtain the more adequate result, we excluded from the study patients with multi-level cervical spine injuries. We analyzed only the patients who underwent uh, suboxial cervical spine surgery when determining the optimal tactic to pursue uh, the surgical goal of spinal cord decompression that depends on the value of vertebral canal compression, suppression of fusion depends on the value of instability, and correction of sagittal profile that mm, depends on the state of uh, segmental deformation. We analyzed retrospectively the value of uh, vertebral canal compression using the original method, the value of instability using cervical spine injury severe, severity score, uh, the state of segmental deformation by determining uh, B segmental and plate angel. The morphologic type of injury was detected with suboxial spine uh, standard algorithm. All surgery was divided. <clears throat> on four types, anterior cervical carpectomy and fusion, anterior cervical discectomy and fusion, laminectomy with and without fusion, and a 360-degree decompression fusion surgery. Uh, the morphologic type of injury distribution is presented uh, by diagram. Almost a half of all injuries is type A, a quarter is type C, and the rest is type B. When assessing the dependence of size of a vertebral canal compression on the type of injury, the following picture is uh, determined. Uh, the highest uh, compression is seen in group A4 and C. According to Kruskal Wallace test, uh, the difference is statistically significant. Here is possible of analysis with the correction for the multiplicity of comparisons. Almost only type C statistically differs from other types. Uh, the same calculations for level of instability. Kruskal Wallace test shows the significance of difference. Uh, the cervical spine injury severity score points change incrementally from A1 to C type. 
uh, post-hogonal is a completely different picture, only type B and C do not statistically differ from each other. And for the state of segmental alignment, the highest values um, are registered for uh, type A2 and C. And uh, the Coxman Whitney test results show that the segmental kyphosis only for two of these types differs from the rest. To assess the strength of dependence of analyzed parameters and AO spine type, we use polynomial regression analysis. The results are as follows. The morphological type of AO spine classification can predict the size of spinal canal compression only in 40% of cases, the value of instability in 54%, and the segmental deformation in 28% of analyzed patients. The multifactor model gives uh, 53%. It means that only in half of cases, L spine type can characterize the main parameters taken into account when determining the tactical, the tactics of surgical treatment. Further analysis of polynomial, polynomial multivariate uh, logistic model is as follows. The ratio of uh, the number of actually registered types and those predicted on the basis of indicators of level of instability uh, the degree of compression of spinal canal and segmental deformity is presented, and more clearly in uh, relative terms. For type A3 and C only, the focused accuracy is more than the half. Enterprise distribution of surgery tactics for different types of injury. Isolated ACDF was used only for type uh, A fractures. For A1 uh, in 50% uh, of cases, A2 9.5, A3 2.4%. In two cases of A3 type and five cases of A4 type, combined fusion was used due to the damage of acid joints with compression of the nerve and roots. In the absolute majority of cases, 83.8% uh, of all A uh, type lesion ACCF was used. For type B1 fractures, ACCF was registered in all cases, while surgical treatment of type B2 and B3 was characterized by almost a, a uniform distribution of ICCF, posterior decompression, and combined methods uh, 34, uh, 30 and 34% for type B2, respectively, and uh, 31. 50, uh, 25 and uh, 43% for type B, uh, B3. With type C lesion, in 56% uh, of cases, we use combined surgery, while in 40% uh, cases, uh, ACCF. The rest was posterior surgery. So we found no statistically significant correlation between AO spine morphological type of lesion and surgery tactics. Conclusion. The AO spine classification for suboxial cervical spine injuries is an effective, convenient, and modern tool for uh, describing the nature of suboxial cervical spine injuries. However, the determination of surgical tactics based only on the morphological type of injury is rather difficult. Further research is required to unify surgical tactics based on the classification type of the lesion. ACCF is the most relevant method for surgical correction of somatic and suboxial cervical spine injury. Uh, no conflict of interest. Thanks for your attention.